Hello, and welcome to Tech Boost TV. Today, I'm going to show you how to install a hard drive and a solid state drive into a Dell T1700 workstation. Before beginning, we recommend checking with the manufacturer to make sure the latest firmware is installed. For this installation, you may need a Phillips head screwdriver. Please check out the quick spec link in the description below to learn more about hard drive and solid state drive compatibility for the Dell T1700. First, ensure your computer is powered off and the power cord is unplugged. Next, press and hold the power button until the white light is completely shut off to ensure there is no residual power remaining on the motherboard. To open the workstation, lift the latch found on the side. The hard drive trays are located near the bottom of the system. Remove a tray and place the hard drive inside ensuring the four pins on the tray line up with the four holes found on the hard drive. Once properly mounted, the hard drive will be flush with the tray, and you can reinsert the tray back into the system. Connect the data and power cables to finish the installation. If you are installing an SSD, the process is the same. However, you will need to mount the drive to a drive bay converter. Some of these converters require the drive to be secured with screws. Others will have pins similar to the 3.5 inch hard drive tray we saw earlier. Once the SSD is secured to the converter, the rest of the process is the same. Just place the tray back in the drive bay and attach the power and data cables. Once everything is in place, you can close the system by reattaching the side panel. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like and subscribe buttons below, and be sure to visit techboost.com to take advantage of our great deals on all your IT hardware needs.